<laughs> Sounds pretty nice. <laughs> Wasn't really, you know, my best race, but I think overall the girls were really, we came out and we uh, formed a team, you know, not really knowing each other, and I'm just, I'm so happy we came and did what we wanted to do. What was, what's this experience been like? This um, exciting, you know, I mean, I got invited to come to a professional meet and try and break a world record with amazing Olympians, and you know, I think it's just something where, it's a once in a lifetime thing, we have to soak it all in, and I'm just, I'm very happy that we, you know, we did what we did today. Can you talk me through your leg, just how Um, I got out pretty well, I knew that the European team was going to have a fast girl, so when she came on me, it kind of pushed me to go faster, and you know, coming down, uh, the back stretch, I just wanted to kind of get that lead back for Brenda and make sure that, you know, I put her in a good position. Uh, my, co my assistant coach, I asked her to. We were going to wear them to run, but they were kind of big, so we, we decided not to. It was amazing, you know. I was out of breath cheering for her and, you know, just watching the clock. She said she was watching the clock while she was running, and it was just um, it was very exciting, you know, coming down to the wire first. Uh, you're all decked out in New Bounce, and a New yes. Bounce team, and a New Bounce meet. Uh, are you considering maybe signing with them? Um, I don't know yet. You know, there's a lot to be considered and a lot to figure out. You know, college first, and then we'll see what goes from there. So come Wednesday, definitely still signing. <laughs> uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Do you have any more races? What's your next race? Uh, I think my state meet in New Jersey. So we'll go back and hopefully open up with a 400 and maybe a 4x4. Four four. Do you have any goals for the like, time so you this year? I don't think so. I think just going out, you know, getting ready for outdoor season, 400 hurdles again, and just building the strength from there. Is there ever tough going back and forth from high school competitions to, you know, pro competitions and then back? Uh, I think I think it's all part of the process, you know. I, I get really good races against some pros, and it helps me, you know, especially in my high school races, to, you know, go out there and just push myself when I don't really have, uh, you know, pro co kind of competition against me. So. Does this happen in high school? No. No, it does not. Nothing like it. Um, you know, there's definitely not as many people, and it was more uh, controlled. You know, I knew what uh, was expected of me and all such, and I was on a relay, so you know, I had a, people to depend on. But I mean, overall, it was kind of the same kind of hype and same kind of expectations for myself. A little bit calmer, yeah, I think. You know, because I knew they were going to do their part as long as I did mine. I try to keep myself relaxed, you know, uh, going down the back stretch, just try to, you know, push past it. And I knew that, you know, she was going to try to push me, so I just tried to keep my composure. Thank you.